Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. And we are on October 25th, 2021. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet. And as well, welcome to another video from daily events worldwide, looking at the volcano activity and planetary positions report for week 40. As we had Mount Etna, pretty good effusive eruption yesterday. And overnight, looking at the time lapse right here, one of the largest volcanoes in the world, yet again, erupting, sending a massive ash cloud northward into Europe. Not to mention we've got La Palma just off the coast of Spain and Africa, letting out massive amounts of SO2. Let's have a quick look at our planetary positions right now, zooming into our sun and its players. As we had Mercury retrograde a couple weeks ago, we definitely saw an uptick in seismicity. Things have calmed down now, but we've got Venus quickly approaching and as well Mars, just total opposite of the Sun right now. And we are about to be let loose alone to Uranus. Over the next couple weeks, not much changing in our positions as Earth will just be going into alignment with Uranus and then out of it by the first week of November and then Venus quickly encroaching running up behind our planet Earth. That is our planetary positions for week 40, 2021. We've got 12 weeks left. 2021. Let's have a look at all of the active and erupting volcanoes. We have 48 across the planet being recorded by Volcano Discovery and as well as Smithsonian. Start now here looking at Popo in Mexico, as well as Santiaguito. Fuego in Guatemala, Talica Volcano and Masaya in Ecuador, down into South America here, Nevadas de Ruiz, as well Reventador and Sangue in Peru. Sabincaya has been erupting for quite some time as well. Last updated on the 10th of October. Further down into Chile here, Nevados de Chilean, and as well the Villarica volcano. Carrying on here to Africa, where we have the active and erupting Nirimirigira and Niragongo. Africa has been seeing that eruption continue on for months now. As well, we have El Dono, Langai Volcano, up into North Africa here with Ert de Ale, Shield Volcano, and then into the Mediterranean, of course, we had the eruptive Etna just yesterday being updated complex strato volcano as well we have stromboli who is continuously erupting as well all of the yellow volcanoes are showing signs of unrest we also have Karinchi who has woken up this week merapi semeru and luatolo through indonesia moving northward here into indonesia where karangatang strato volcano has just been updated as well eruption showing yesterday as well Ibu and Dokono and then of course into Japan we had the Aso volcano erupt this week here we're showing Swiss and Ajima Sekirajima and as well Aso volcano notable here the submarine volcanoes Nishinashima and as well Fukutoku just recently we had a 5.1 earthquake here, Marianas Trench, 
watching for more submarine volcanoes to wake up there. Looking through Kamchatka now, Shivalich, Karamiski, and Ebuko. Through the Aleutian Islands here, Semis Nepochnoi, the Great Sitkin, and as well Pavlov through Alaska. Hawaiian Islands here, Kilauea, still erupting. We had a full moon over an erupting crater the other day. Down into Papua New Guinea, where it's been active this week as well. Many earthquakes. We had the Kadavor volcano awaken, Manam, Langila, and as well, Bagana. And a pretty sizable eruption, Yasser volcano as well. Just yesterday, the same day as Etna, a very massive, effusive eruption. Notable here, showing signs of unrest still, the White Island volcano. I've seen some pretty recent earthquakes there. And as well, the mighty Erubus in their southern hemisphere, the only active and erupting volcano towards Antarctica. Looking here, Iceland. Three volcanoes showing signs of unrest. Fagradisvalli, Grinsvun, and as well, Askja volcano. Definitely not erupting like it was back in March 2020. All of the action and lava seems to be coming out of Etna and as well, La Palma. So overall, 48 volcanoes in continuing eruption status. Looking at a long list here of the 48 active and erupting across the planet. Last update from two weeks ago, we were sitting at 51 volcanoes or 50, I'm not sure. But still, this is double our normal amount of 20 to 25, maybe 30 volcanoes erupting daily. Having a quick look here at Null School, showing all of the sulfur emissions being spread across our planet right now especially across North America. Wow, thick particles of SO2. And right across Europe, as I mentioned, we had La Palma and as well Etna. Massive SO2 and CO2 emissions coming out of the 48 volcanoes across the planet. Look at Australia. Wow. Also going to quickly look here at windy.com showing the SO2 models for the coming days. I want to thank everybody for tuning in to the Volcano Activity Report and as well planetary positioning. Much love to y'all. Prayers for humanity. Thanks for watching today. This has been Mike with your Morning Dew. Daily events worldwide. Stay safe out there. Aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your Morning Dew. Bye-bye now. Please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.